Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see how to fix Logitech G Hub not opening problem. Before moving on to the video guys, you can support me by liking the video and deliver this video to people who are looking for this video like you. Let's fix it guys. First we need to turn off the Logitech G Hub. Don't forget to check the task manager as well. Right click on the taskbar and select task manager. Sometimes the services of the application that we have closed may continue to run in the background. Right click on it and select end task it guys. As you can see the updater is running in the background. We need to close it. Right click on it and select end task it. And after closing it close out of here. Now you just want to go to search menu and type installed app. Click on open it guys. Search here Logitech, Logitech G Hub. Click on this three dot icon, select modify, select yes. Now you just want to select reinstall G Hub and select reinstall. If we do not want our settings to be deleted here, we need to tick this transfer my current settings and select reinstall guys. After the installation of Logitech G Hub is finished, we need to close out of here and now we need to open as an administrator run as administrator and check our problem has been resolved or not this is our first solution guys after following these steps if you still having a problem let's move on to the second solution guys second solution is to change the startup type of logitech g hub we open task manager i click on it and select task manager then click on startup apps in here you just want to right click on the logitech g hub and select enable guys after enabling it close out of here go to search menu and type services click on open it guys now in here you just need to search for lg hub updater service as you can see this service is currently running for the next step we need to turn this off guys right click on it and select stop on the blank area on right side you just need to right click on it and select refresh guys after doing it double click on the logitech gtub updater service and now you just want to select startup type to automatic and if the service status is stopped you just want to start it guys again we just restarting select apply and ok this is our second solution guys now you can open logitech g hub and check your problem resolved or not if you still having a problem let's move on to the third solution guys third solution is to download the old version of logitech g hub before doing this we need to completely delete the logitech g hub we will use geek uninstaller guys for it for that open up web browser and search for geek uninstaller click on the first official website click on it select the download option select the zip file after getting download done click on the file and double click on the geek application now click on yes now right click on the logitech g hub and select uninstall guys if you want our current settings not to be deleted we need to tick save my current settings and select uninstall guys now we have uninstalled successfully logitech g hub guys select quit click on close now close out of here now we can download the old version of logitech g hub guys now we can download the old version guys i will be given pinned command guys you can click on it and you can access the website guys click on the download option and download it guys after getting download done click on it and install it guys after installation complete click on this three slash icon select settings now you want to uncheck this box guys enable automatic updates after doing this use it without any problem guys i hope one of these solution fixed the problem if the video helped you don't forget to like the video you can also subscribe and support me guys thank you